Let them go. You. The gods' most cherished child. I... How do you know that name? How wouldn't I know your name? Your debacle is the reason I'm down here. What? How? You... Still obsessed with your... Connection to them? So eagerly yearning to hear their voices. The many years you've spent crying out, calling for them has left you deaf to their call. In the end, it doesn't matter. You have betrayed the gods' faith the same way you have failed Harrion. Soon a rain of fire will fall on these lands. I want you to remember, as you hear the agonizing cries of the people you have failed, this is all your fault. I don't understand. No, you don't understand. Looking for a cure for the corrosion? Saving the world? Becoming a saint? Overthrowing the elders? The gods told me that the path would reveal itself to me. Yes, and still you were blinded to the side. You'd rather follow a path dictated by your insatiable pride! This is impossible. Why would I lie? I'm the last of the gods' servants. Okay, now enough with the bombastic terrains. And you, of all the people who opposed me, you are without doubt the most insignificant. That you've never been beaten up by a trap before. I'll try to be gentle. Oh, I'm in for it now, right? You know very well I'm not referring to your attire. You are no threat to me because you have no self-worth. Your body is not a suitable home anymore. The divine spark you swore to keep alive has died, Carnelian. Carnelian? You know nothing about me! You are painful to behold, a tear in the very fabric of magic. Killing you will be an act of mercy. Well, we'll see about that. No, oh, the pain! The pain, my life is pain. Please end my suffering. Push the. Look at me like that. Please don't look at me. Shut up. By the will of the gods. Ooh. Wish. Ooh. I'm Wish. the last of the Carnelians. I will cut you open. Hey. Uh. Out of the way. Ooh. Ooh. Out of the way. Uh. Darkness before dawn. Why have the gods stopped talking to me? Am I not... Uh. Everything must go as planned. Don't you... You're wasting your time. I'm quite... By the will of the gods. 
Ugh. Darkness before dawn. The bearer of destruction is not here to help you. You have. Before dawn.
Celine. Celine! Are you all right? Oh, what? Huh? What happened? It's okay. He ran away. He ran away? How? I pulled a dirty trick. Compelled it to leave while it was ahead. How did you do it? No matter. We have to follow it. Wait. What is our plan here? Just whistle for a Nekaru and throw ourselves at that creature again? Must I remind you of what just happened? There is no part of what just happened that I have forgotten, Carnelian. Okay. Let's just stop for a moment here, Selene. I have no intention of making amends for who I am or to who or what I worship, and especially not because of some stupid immemorial religious feud neither of us had a part in. I believe there are more pressing matters at hand. You're right. I know you mean well, but we'll have to talk about it at some point. And you will hide nothing from me. Okay. And by the way, what was that bit about the gods most cherished? Okay, found you. Priestess, your brother is- Where's Darian? Did you leave him alone out there? He covered for me while I- While you ran away! Is that it? <sighs> You've gotta go look for him, now. You'll tell me your story on the way. Hey, let me remind you that I'm supposed to be here to provide transport and help you find that cure, not to- Are you going to charge us extra for doing your duty too? Is that the kind of person you are, Fallon? Then hurry up and name your price. Damn it. What do you say to that? What do you think? Is she right, Asaurus? Or should I punch her in the mouth? Ah, <sighs> don't ask me. One thing is sure, I'm beginning to understand why she's in charge. Is that really you? Am I... dead? <laughs> Typical Darian. Glass always half empty. You find me alive and the first thing you think is that we must both be dead. We're both... alive? Is that true? Hey, are you... crying or something? I... It's just... It's been so long since anything good happened to me. Are you telling me... I'm something good? Yes. You certainly are. <laughs> well... I don't know if we'll be alive for much longer. The Ascendants, huh? It seems like no matter what we do or where we go, our destiny is to get slaughtered on the closest altar. Oh, by the way, I've got something for you. What is it? A present. I was supposed to give it to you during our date, but, you know, things happened. Is this...? Yeah, Zandra told me you were collecting little wooden figures. I remembered your weird fetish for Anselm, so I started carving this during my breaks. And you've kept it with you? All this time? Uh, yeah, I don't know why. I guess I just... 
didn't know what to do with it, really. <laughs> it looks so stupid! Hey, I did my best! I love it, Darian. I really love it. We have no quarrel with you. Please go. Darkness before dawn. Would this be? The Gates of Gideon, Isaurus. Everyone knows that. A vestige of the long-forgotten past. People usually think that these are just natural landmarks. Crystals that somehow formed randomly into this gigantic structure. But of course, it has to have been done by design. Wait, what do you mean by that? I mean that our ancestors knew how to grow these crystals, and how to form them into certain shapes. Uh huh. You don't believe me? The proof is before your very eyes. This door has been open for eons, and now... It's closed. Someone knows how to control them. And by someone, I mean these guys. So, we wait here until one of them goes inside. I have a better idea. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. What are you going to do to me now? Repurpose you, using nanomachines. You what? what? Nano-machines? It's kinda like fairy dust, but for machines. Fairy d Absolutely not! That is not fairy dust, it is much more complicated and... Way. How does someone like you know how to use nano machines? And how did you get a hold of those? I'm world class. That's all you need to know. Do you intend to put me into that body? T completely inefficient. Take that one. 
Over there. This one? Affirmative. Nice choice. What the hell? Quite fitting, actually. Hey, this thing just tried to kill us. Do you really think it's wise to give it that body? Relax, buddy. It's all under control. We need your help. My brother... No need to explain. I distinctly recall all the past events. Your sibling needs my help. And I cannot refuse, since I must obey your orders. Actually... Let me access the unit's memory. Ugh, such an abdicated system. It's a miracle these things can even walk. Ah, uh, here it is. I know how to open it. Wait a second. What should we call you? Um, typical human reaction? Now you see me walking on two legs, you suddenly wonder what to call me. And? This body feels like a weapon of mass destruction. I think Thea sounds nice. Thea, huh? Affirmative. Start gathering datas. So, the bearer of destruction 
in the flesh. I have no idea what you're talking about. I know more about you than you think. Stuff even you don't know yet, buddy. Like my name? Did you know it's Oberos? Sure beats the doppelganger. Now <laughs> that's a mouthful. Oberos. Yeah. Right. Do you? Oh, Darian, don't bother. I already know what's on your mind. Can I fight him? No, we both know you're outmatched. You don't even have your really, really big sword with you. And that wound on his chest? <laughs> you noticed that, didn't you? You'll never get anywhere near it. Can I jump? Nah, I'll break your legs, pal. So, I guess it's all over for you. But... Since I know how you're feeling right now, I'd say I'll be doing you a favor by killing you. Ooh, it's hard being in your skin. Hmm, where does all this self-loathing come from? Well, even with my face, you still sound like Korra. I guess humiliating others is a mutual passion. And now you're just poking about blindly, trying to see what makes me tick. Nice try. Nice try. But you can't cheat your way out of this. Like you cheated your way out of the war, deserter. You're a coward. Saving your mother. Protecting your sister. Excuses. The Ascendants broke you. The death of your squad broke you. When you woke in the snow, your mind was already gone. You just walked, away from it all. You didn't even realize you were deserting. The hell you know! Even I know it, Darian. That letter. I didn't send it because I needed help. I sent it so that you would desert. To protect you. Because I knew I could use Ilvana's decree to put you out of the consort's reach. At the risk of my own life. Selene! What did you do to her?! It's over. Now, the seed of destruction will be mine! <laughs> did Ovara teach you nothing? Ovara? What? Who are you? Hmm. You don't seem to remember. Curious. Maybe I misjudged your powers. I will make sure that this time, nothing stands in the way of your bloom. You'll thank me. Later. <laughs> What's happening here? Is that Darian over there? There's no time to lose. Let's go!